Hello and welcome to Sports Hub. Thank you so much for joining us. We're coming to you live from Mask Media Complex in Lusaka. My name is Modern Ntapechela Sinkala. Today I'm hosting two young drafters who have taken the country by storm. The two will be representing Zambia at the World Championships in Bulgaria. So stay with us. I'll introduce them shortly. Feel free to participate on the program by calling the numbers that will be crawling on the screen. Uh, these are 0211 253025 or 0211 WhatsApp message 0955 202904. 0955 202904. Then you reach us. And uh, if you are into social media, Facebook and all that, the Page is a sports hub Facebook page or modern in color sports so that's how you can reach us then uh, we have a segment we call how much do you know your sportsmen and women on this segment the last time we were here live I showed you a photo where there were three sportsmen and I asked you to identify them who are those three sportsmen and women I mean, only sportsmen. <laughs> Who are those uh, sportsmen? So we had one response, and uh, this one is coming from uh, Gracious Mudenda of Kamanga, Lusaka, who said Kalusha Bwalia, Johnston Bwalia, and Eston Mulenga. <laughs> okay, nice one. I like it that you tried at least. Well tried. Actually, you are better than those that didn't even attempt. So the correct answer, actually, you got right. You got it right on one name. Yes, Kalusha is there. The one on the left, that's Kalusha Bwalia. You all know Kama left. Uh, he scored incredible goals for Zambia. Then that one in the middle, that's the late David Eford Chavala, Zambia's number one. He died in uh, the plane crash in 1993 along with... Uh, uh, the other players. Then the one on the right is uh, Charles Musonda. I'm sure you remember the midfield genius, Charles Musonda. So those are the players. Uh, so well done to Gracious Kamanga for trying. So I have another photo for you. Hope this one you managed to identify. The number will be crawling on the screen. Who is that sportsman? I'm sure for those of you who've been following sports and have been watching TV, even on social media, he's been all over. So pick up that call and tell me who that sportsman is. So far, he's doing it for Zambia. So the numbers, like I said earlier, only 0211 25 or 0211 On WhatsApp, 0955 Facebook. It's uh, sports, our Facebook page, or Modern Sinkala Sports. Let's look at what happened over the weekend uh, at the Commonwealth Games. We'll start with the Commonwealth Games. They are done now, and Zambia ripped three medals. One gold medal, one silver medal, and one bronze medal. So the, the gold medal came through an uh, runner. Uh, in the name of Muzala Samkonga, who ripped a gold medal. Then a uh, silver medal came through a boxer. This is Steven Zimba. I once hosted him on this show, and uh, he was positive that at some point he was going to rip something great, and he brought a silver medal to Zambia. And uh, the other medal, which was a bronze, was ripped by Patrick Chinyemba. So well done, boys, for raising the flag of Zambia up, high up there in Birmingham. So uh, looking forward to the Olympic medal now. It's been long since Zambia won an Olympic medal. The last time was in 1996 through Samuel Matete who won a silver medal. By the way, Zambia has only won two medals at the Olympic Games from uh, inception, from uh, independence. The first one was in 1984 through Keith uh, Muira. And then the second one through Samuel Matete. So we need more medals even at Olympic mm, uh, level. Let's now go to rugby in the Zambia Rugby Union League. Rescheduled games played on Saturday. It was Lusaka, Neo, KPF 10, uh, Red Arrows 22, Muflira Leopards 16, Mkwazi 23, Kansanshi 21. In the women's category, it was Red Arrows 24, Muflira Leopards, they says, 
15. So Red Arrows won both games in the men's and women's categories. Let's go to basketball now in the Midlands Basketball Association NBA League Week 1 games. In the Super League, which is for the men, it was LCC Lutas 82, Bulldogs 86, Heroes Play United 57, Matero Magic 87, Green Buffaloes 51, then Napsa Hurricanes 57, Matero Warriors 80, Husky 69, Munali Suns 53, Red Arrows 45, Unza Pesa 60, Hawks 73. In the Feminine League, it was Dolphins 71, Nishati Shells 28, Green Buffaloes 59, Napsa Breeze 62, Unza Hannes 80, Mystics, this is a new team, 36, Magic Sparks 50, Hot Spurs 34. Okay, that's in uh, basketball. Let's now go to football in the CAF Women's Champions League. Kosafa qualified. It was held in South Africa. Green Buffaloes was representing Zambia. And, well, they did Zambia proud. After lifting the trophy, they beat the highly fancied Mamelody Sundowns by six goals to five on post-match penalties or penalty shootouts after the match ended new all. Well done, Green Buffalo's women's football team. Well done, Nyanta girls. Well done. Keep working hard. So this means Green Buffalo's have now qualified to uh, the CAF uh, Champions League for women, which will be held in Morocco. So the likes of um, Irene Lungu, uh, Martha Tembo, the likes of Lucio Momwemba, will be going back to Morocco. Remember, they were representing Zambia at the Africa Women Championship, and now they will be representing uh, Green Buffaloes. So that was the result. Well done, Green Buffaloes. And the team is back, arrived to a thunderous welcome. So that's it in terms of uh, women's football, which is on the rise. Let's go to men's football now. The Samo Zoom and Love with Charity Shield, which was played on Saturday at Nkoloma Stadium. It was Red Arrows 1 and Napsa Stars nil. I'm sure it was a sweet revenge for Red Arrows. Remember, Napsa Stars beat Red Arrows by a go to nil in the Apsa Cup. So it was a revenge for Red Arrows after they won the Charity Shield. The game was played at Nkoloma Stadium. But uh, can you imagine these two teams again? They are playing uh, this weekend as uh, the league uh, starts. So it will be Red Arrows facing Napsa Stars again. So how will it be? Will it be a draw this time around? Or maybe Red Arrows will continue where they've started from. Um, so it was a tight game. Um, uh, people who were there at Nkoloma Stadium, most of them are saying, anyway, Napsa started on a high, but then Red Arrows had that chance through Joseph Peary and scored. So congratulations to Red Arrows. We'll see how the two teams will play this weekend. Let's wrap it up in terms of results with uh, the English Premier League. I don't know which team you support, but uh, the results were as follows. In, on Saturday, it was Aston Villa 2, Everton 1, Arsenal 4, Leicester City 2, Brighton and Hove Albion nil, Newcastle United nil. Remember Brighton and Hove Albion, that's where Enoch Mwepu plays. He came in as a substitute. Manchester City 4. And uh, Bournemouth, nil. Southampton, two. Leeds United, two. Wolverhampton Wanderers, nil. Fulham, nil. Brentford, four. Manchester United, nil. Yes, yes, it's a correct scoreline. Manchester United, nil. And Brentford, four. Sunday, it was Nottingham Forest, one. West Ham United, nil. Chelsea, two. Tottenham Hotspurs, nil. So um, right now, as we are talking, uh, the game has kicked off between Liverpool and Crystal Palace. They are playing. It's getting hotter and hotter in the English Premier League. So on top right now is Manchester City, who have six points. So two out of two. Then Arsenal also have two out of two after they beat Leicester City uh, by four goals to two. Leicester City, where Patson Daka plays, and Patson Daka came in as a substitute. So losing there to Arsenal. Well, we'll see uh, how things will pan out this weekend. So before I introduce my guests in the studio, uh, let's dance to a song done by MC Wabuino titled Ona Kayako. Mingala 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 tu. Yeah. Ati mingala 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 tu. Yeah. Ma Zambia ni jipolo polo mare. Ni jipolo polo. Ma Zambia ni jipolo polo mare. Ni 
Okay, on a kayak by MC Wabu in a pef polo polo nafi fula number, could if you polo polo more athletics, could if you polo polo women, number pakola one if you polo polo of yamu drafts. Okay, time for me to introduce my guests. Like I said earlier on, they are drafters and quite young. The first one is 16 year old William Chinzewe. He recently became the youngest federation master. He has been so sensational and he has been beating. Oh, big people actually. So a warm welcome to Sports Hub, William. We also have uh, another young man, 20 years of age, Avanivandola, Avanandola from the Copper Belt. His name is Elijah Chanda, aka Chameleon. We'll be finding out where this name Chameleon came from. And he's William's biggest competitor. Welcome to Sports Hub. And uh, last but not least, Zambia Drafts Federation General Secretary, Rafael Perry. Welcome to Sports Hub, gentlemen. You can come and uh, join me here so that we hear your stories. So actually, the three of them, you can come and sit here. The three of them are going to the World Championships in Bulgaria. By the time you'll be coming at the airport, I'm sure Pastor Makembo will be there to come and drum up support if you come, uh, if you come with medals. Yeah. So, gentlemen, <coughs> welcome to Sports Hub. Thank you. Thank, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. All right. So, um, let me start with you, GS. Tell us about uh, this, this World Cup and um, how many are representing Zambia and how ready the team is. Oh, wow. Uh, this program is a very important program to Zambian drafters, as you put it. Uh, it's, a, it's a youth championship. Uh, that is the World Youth, uh, uh, World youth Championship. And we have uh, two players, as you, you might see. There is William Christian Chinzewe, who is the national champion for both the seniors and the juniors. He's not just a champion for the juniors, but he's also a champion for the seniors and the juniors. Uh, he's Lusanne Fred, and he plays for Ch uh, Chaise Draft Club. And the other gentleman uh, is uh, Mr. Uh, Elijah, Elijah Chanda. Chanda. He's from the Copper Belt in Dola, to be specific, uh, from uh, Mushidi. Uh, he's the silver medalist for both the juniors uh, and the seniors as well. So these are very competitive players. Uh, additionally, William is also in Brazilian drafts, is also a world champion and online Olympiads. Mm -hmm. And as okay. such, uh, IDF, which is the motherboard, the world uh, board, the International Drafts Federation, uh, they thought probably online there could be some aspects of cheating due to advancement in technology. Mm. They wanted to test him on a physical board. Mm. So he's been tested on a physical board where he was sent to Malawi early this year to just in have a look at the young man. Mm. Uh, he hammered the titled players and he reigned supreme, uh, raising the Zambian flag high. So this is it about it. So this championship is starting on the 21st of of, uh, of, of August and it will run through up to the 1st of September. And uh, additionally to that, we I'm going also to be trained in arbitration. We've got one person, one athletic arbiter, who is myself, will be trained in arbitration okay. for the notations because uh, these guys have to be vested in notation recordings. Mm. So I'll pick up that role. In Africa, currently, we only have one arbiter who is based in Blantyre, Malawi. So the entire Africa, Zambia should also boast because I'm the second one to be trained in arbitration in that regard for the game. So this is a plus to our game. Two athletes, three plus the arbiter. And we've got the other one, Mr. Dingiswa Jere, who is representing us, the vice president for ZDF. Mm. He will represent us in the elective general assembly. So each one has got his specific roles. And uh, on top of that, we've got other government officials from the Minister of Youth, Sports and Art, who will also accompany us with various roles as they accompany us. So it's a, it's a very well-organized team, fully packed team. Nice one, nice one. Thank Let you. me start with William. How did you start playing drafts? Who, who inspired you? 
uh, I was in, being inspired by one candidate, and that candidate is Mr. Mwanza Sakala. Mm. Yes, he used to play draft very well, and then I got inspired when I heard that he, he also traveled to Russia to go and play draft. So I thought as if he, I would uh, also become the same and represent the nation. Okay. Uh, uh, where did you start your draft from? I started uh, playing draft in Kaunda Square okay. when I was uh, eight years old. Hmm. Okay. Uh, like, what came through your mind? I mean, uh, maybe boys of that age, eight, they would want to play football, but you, you chose drafts. Why? I chose draft because I saw it, it could make me become intelligent in terms of uh, other subjects like uh, mathematics and sciences at school. Mm -hmm. Okay. So when you joined uh, in Kaunda Square, um, I know there are, wh which clubs are in Kaunda Square? That's Kaunda Square, the same Kaunda Square. Is this Kaunda Square? Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. How were you received as an eight-year-old boy, you know, trying to play drafts? Um, Actually, when we used to stay at Kaunda Square, when I started playing draft, we uh, I, I only played the draft for about uh, one year to uh, three months, and then we shifted. We went to SOS. Mm -hmm. That's why that's how I connected to Chaisa Draft Club and started participating in Chaisa Draft Club instead of Kaunda Square. Okay, but where you've been playing when you were home, like you maybe you'd draw, you'd make a board, you're playing with your family or with with the friends at home. Yes, of course. Ah. Okay. Did you think drafts would be something that would maybe take you far or maybe you were just playing for fun? Yes, I was just playing for fun and never knew to say it would take me far. I could have, have such a huge opportunity to participate in the World Youth Championship. I just used to play for fun and never knew to say uh, such opportunities could come. Okay. All right. Let's do for Goku Nandola. Chameleon, first tell us about yourself. Who is the chameleon? My twenty con in non chameleon to what the chameleon, chameleon. Oh, chameleon, I'm been who pitched a money draft. Hm. Nam be the condo copper belt and I'm bidding at ten years. Okay. Upon I'm bidding, Avanandi, Vadian Secatio, why you at them with your madoff? What a day off your boat. I never Mm. Okay. 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 Abadin Sunga, Vanko by Justin. Badi Samunam of Future Marine. Mba and Bidio Kun sponsor of Kun Sunga, Kun Sunga Nade Kala Canon of Wakanyam. After Kun Sunga, if your number, Aba Nain get a more draft Chawama Club. Ya Veda Chawam and Aba member after Naba member. I must sponsor Fidafine at its sponsor. Na lelo sama ama game wa yakunu. Ndibalelandatu Mm bed on buffets, Areva Pala, Pactiva Twadi de Uyuin Omut Mokta advice. Nava Nandibon Sava Teakwama game Mukombo Navena, 
Bene no kapanto resa ala pangenshira pasha ii ne draft ala tufisha na na kubao kedi. Eko shade tonton kani hapo atilimbi. Tukafika kwa kubao kedi. Tuwale mwanafe kuno kudosa keko na hale mwanate kubao kedi ya eko bazungu. So no mbo kuisa sangati. Kuisa sangati kubao kedi ya ukwini. Tulina kusika. Andeta shadesa. Na imu ama sponsors na wako chaba. Wow. <laughs> wow. So, <laughs> what Chameleon is saying is saying that actually it was um, he started from a humble background, and people were discouraging him that no, these drafts you are playing. So people who don't have things to do. Why instead of playing football, you want to start playing drafts? But he didn't give up. He played. Um, he started from Ndola, then came to Lusaka. Started playing for Chawama Drafts Club, and now here he is. Uh, he'll be going to Bulgaria. So, number, um, apota ola yamba, but when you walk some bidi so kute. Oh, na de sangwa pavakur, so pambi varin tanfi, na quit ten years. Watch it by your size, you de sangwa pavakur. So, in an ade tambafi, Fidafini, van tanfia, naya, foot time time na wed, abadeng gumfida for Savakur, van de tape, na tear two games. Vaum for winner, mm, two games are left in a drug of a good. My dog winner, Fidafin. So in a echona monafe, uncle, each in two. Kula, kula, teafe, na interest. Mm -hmm. Interest, Fidafin, a deesa, no quishiva, alone de shiva, shy shiva and cascapa no ponas. Mm -hmm. So support the avantu, Nababene, about to be caco mo, about to be caco mo crab. Mm -hmm. Eva dengo kweva ti ine nseli so ndeta shasana inchito eo vaikata na ine nde pepe shapakuti ifi ne vade ngafa na ine ngafu eko wava nanti pantu unlezari temo muntu uupera ku uupera mm -hmm. ukupitira ukupera na angwa mano na angwa device le mm -hmm. satafu wa abantu wa wakasa pakuti mm -hmm. game ii I game we had a yala cool. Shark with the pitch roto. It's a quiver ticker could a game and I didn't want a theater. Bambina won back on a mute token. I didn't want a theater. Game we can she find fiance. There's a win. I did she won my party to Munt Bakti. Muntu acid. Okay. So I tell out Chapa Ma sports YMB apart from drafts. Na richitire po bola iye ya kumodo. No mbanga natea bola baada nsekati. Bola iye ne ure ipanta wirafi. Niwe wachi pante pante. So na alimwe na teka diya ya nje. Ankozi. Nje sheko fimbi. Pakuti baada nje wachi pante pante. Na isha ako draft na ikati. Paka nafika nepo pano pomfikire alo baade sabatiri baade tisesha yeah, yeah. ok <laughs> kutuwa ewa kwa shani <laughs> kutuwa ewa kwa shani baade hapo nsaba ale kusekati no game ya malo ufua uh, apano mbanari puma no mbolea na kuma world championships kuba ujera kutuwa ewa kwa shani hapa ale kutamba pali inoshita na hapa ale kuseka ponsa kamera yobe niri hapa hapa mm. ale nseka efe ni ngabeba kutina abeba ati Mm Twira se cafedero, to the pepera covanes, and abe and deva peperaco. Pacti in a shfuid oak wake a shetchy be pavanant. Pan to buy boy at the canoe could wake a shetchy be patchy. So Abba didn't say canabo, deva pepera, quadro and chidden deva peperaco. Pacti vamone, ubusumo work or is at Munto, fionso for a pera de so for a day cut a conang ni conductor inch to unsafe oil each to Munto. Mm -hmm. Ika kulok pitida, muruso ulo akwadesa, tuida monafe kuns, le sefia vi kamit mashesu, nangwe motuende, mm -hmm. fin tui fing. Okay. So nawe nandeva pepeda kopakti, vaka vade kula modi game we abo, ne fin tui fe vade chit. Ok, alright. Um, William, um, your, your, your game, um, you've been playing for, you started with Kaunda Square then came to Chaisa. Um, how did you develop your game to start even beating big people? I developed my game through regular practice. I used to practice each and every day. 
And then uh, when I used to stay at home, I used to get a board and start checking my games whenever I make a mistake if someone beats me. Mm. Yes, but I never knew to say I would have such an, a huge opportunity to participate in the World Youth Championship. Okay. Wow. Um, so um, which are some of the big players that you faced that were beating you that time, but this time it's just <laughs> I walk over? One of them is Mwanza Sakala, mm. Elijah Chanda himself, mm. and Mr. Matthews Makina. Okay. Also, the other federation master, Kennedy Pidi. All those were beating you when you were young. Yes. But this time, <laughs> you are uh, forced to reckon with. You forgot one, one, uh, one person, the Grandmaster. Grandmaster International. The Grandmaster International. Mm, okay. Richard Mwamba. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, so at the moment when you, when you play uh, your game, how do you feel about yourself when you are when you're playing uh, local games? Uh, <coughs> Whenever I'm playing in local games, I feel like practicing and then uh, though most of the people, like he said, they like Elijah Chanda, most of the people they like to discourage us saying that no draft team to say you never go anywhere with draft, just concentrate to school only because draft Yamalofwa Tamwaka Yokuri Konse Mwai Che Mwe I know a draft to just disturb your future William. Mm -hmm. Stop playing draft nefiaku kwere in deke if you fia u fiteti mweokuri konse. We appreciate the new Don government for fully sponsoring uh, minor sports such, such as draft, chess, and many others. Okay. Have you ever uh, uh, played any other sports code apart from draft? I also used to play football. Mm. Yes, Dore, he also used to tell me to say, ah, no, William, we uka diva uku bola, ilea uku kusaidi, <laughs> then we dipa uwa we know, ule te afi efi draft ifi fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you've only tried football and the drafts. Yes. Uh, when you went into drafts, you, f you saw that uh, things were just flowing. Yes, and then others are still telling me, no, you need to start trying chess. <laughs> oh, have you ever tried chess? No. Okay. Camillion, have you ever tried chess? No. Okay. <laughs> we, 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 we will teach them. Mm. Actually, this is one of the things that I was speaking with, I think, with the, uh, when I was with the church, chess president, that probably they need, because those, we use the same board. Draft and chess, they use the same board. Okay. There is no difference. The notations are the same. It's only the pieces that changes when we change, we switch to the other game. Mm. Myself, I'm a very, very strong player for chess. Mm. Yeah, but oh, okay. uh, draft, mm. I'm a player, but I'm, I'm more in administration. I'm an administrator. Okay. I'm a very good ad administrator. So these uh, boys, I think uh, uh, modern, uh, if you may be aware, they are the cream of Zambian draft. They are the cream. We are not they just are young, but they are the cream. They are the cream. We are not just taking participants. Mm. We rip medals. Uh, for your information, we are defending African champions in drafts, 64. Okay. A feat which we achieved in Blantyre, Malawi, in 2018. So some of the players, I was teaching them notations for the first time, but they did extremely well. And we ended up producing our own grandmaster, which is Lukanga Joseph Mambwe. Mm -hmm. And we also brought the African Cup to Zambia. So this time around, these boys, trust me, when we are back, we'll bring medals. We'll come back with the medal here to display, to, and we'll raise the Zambian flag high. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, the other thing which William has mentioned, which is very important, is we need to uh, recognize the efforts of the new Dawn government. Mm. Think they are pro sport. And uh, we are very happy because we are correlating well with the Minister of Sports, National Sports Council. They are people of integrity, people that really have nothing but to promote sport. You see, sports. This can time it's the real Minister of Sport. Exactly. And like it used to be where it was. 
people are calling it as a minister of football. <laughs> yeah, no, it's not a minister of football anymore. Mm. It's mm. now minister of sports because we are also covered and we are proudly covered and we should also, I should also uh, thank Honorable Elvis Nkandu, he's been very supportive, uh, PS uh, Chileshikangwa and the team, the entire team at the Minister of Sports, they've been very supportive whenever we call on them. They've been extremely supportive and we give them kudos for that. And also, you see, sports can create employment. The youth normally have less things to do. Instead of them engaging in illicit activities, but here they are, they're representing the nation. The other day, we had another youth, uh, uh, you, you've mentioned uh, Muzala Samkonga. He minted God. Sports is about investment. It creates other opportunities. So these boys, once they go, they come back, they mint medals. They'll create imp uh, opportunities for themselves. They'll have something to benefit out of it. Probably uh, William and the others, they can even uh, get scholarship out of it. We've seen other young uh, students, they ended up getting scholarship out of sport. So this is a very important undertaking. It's not just about participation, but it's also about job creation. It's also about removing the, uh, the mindset of, uh, of youth being overlooked or uh, not being junks, not being called junks. We've got a high uh, uh, rate of junks in Zambia. But if we give them something to do, sports is one of the things which is a solution based, which can create a lot of uh, opportunities and a lot of goodwill for the country. Okay. So talking about the same sport, drafts, yes, even me when I was growing up, I remember we could play at home just for playing. I didn't think it could be a serious sport that would um, take someone out of the country and all that. Um, how are you developing the sport? Because up to now, the sport is just still played in the markets. There's nothing like maybe you have a specific building where people can go practice drafts and, and all that. What are you doing as, as a federation? Well, uh, as a federation, uh, this is one of the things that we are trying to spread across. Uh, currently, it was dominant in Lusaka. We, mm -hmm. have, we have a number of clubs in Lusaka, about uh, 18 or 20. Mm -hmm. But we are expanding our tentacles to other provinces. And currently, uh, early this year or late last year, our ZDF president, Mr. Rafael Lesa, my namesake, also had a visit to Eastern Province where he established a few structures. And the, uh, come next year, uh, one of the key programs of, of the game is to spread to other provinces. Currently, we have some, 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 some branches in Dola, uh, uh, in Copper Belt to be specific. Uh, that is Kitu and Dola and the other surrounding areas. And also, we want to spread to other provinces. In like uh, Southern Province, we have representation. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, Eastern because the province, sport is played all over the country. Yeah, it's, it's played mm -hmm. all over. But mm -hmm. we need now to teach them the international standards. Okay. So that's where now the, the issue of, of investing in sport itself. You see, even medals to come, to a country, either be it Olympic, be it football, be it uh, any, any type of sport, there has to be investment. Mm -hmm. Investment, you need to train the people. Mm -hmm. When you train the people to the desired level, they'll bring medals. Medals don't just flow from heaven. They have, we have to invest in human resource. The greatest asset which ZNBC has, any other institution has, it's human resource. Mm -hmm. So, including draft, the greatest investment which we have is to invest in people, teach them the right standards, teach them, we take them to school, we teach them to compete favorably with whoever, then we're definitely going to do that. So next so year, we going to see mm -hmm. the, the National League, for instance, Chaisa, Chaisa are the champions. Yeah, where William, where comes, William from. comes from. And where so Camillion comes from, they are runners up. Ah, okay, so, Chawama. Yes. So let's say Chaisa goes to play a team in Mukushi, for instance, or maybe in the, in Indola, like national championship, are we seeing something like that? Definitely, this is what we are working on. But currently, we want them to be, uh, because due to financial constraints, we, may not, we don't have that muscle to travel each and every week or a fortnight. But we want them to have the, the districts or the provincial. They can have a provincial league, provincial league, provincial league. Then when it comes to national, they'll come and now play maybe 
in a number of days or five okay. days in one or, place yes okay. in one place those that have qualified from the the provinces okay. so this is the system that we're devising and sooner than later we'll be able to do that apparently mm -hmm. We've also uh, generated an academy, that's Zambia Draft Federation Academy. They had their games at uh, East Park this Saturday uh, with uh, Musongo Shamirimo and the other members, and it was very successful. So we want that to build that up, and we'll roll it over to the schools. To the schools. Once we roll it over to the schools, I think we would have a good footing would be able to produce very, very good sportsmen. Right. So wherever you are out there, you've heard, you can get in touch with the Zambia Draft Federation so that you can form up a league wherever you are. Then later on, you play the national championship. I know draft is played all over, all over. And uh, you just have to learn um, the international way of playing, like he put it. First, how did this name Chameleon come about? His nickname is Aishireshan. I am 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 Na ba dia ba ni ebonde te anabo na ba kwata na nguto di eight, mm. which means in any short. So for dia fine today te today te we na toa shara eight in a five. Ba la landa t na ip na ip o game. Na ina cho na ip o game kanch tu te te ko. Difena confidence iria. So ngaba bi ke solo today te today te. Nala tera dara in. Nala tera fe dara. In binara ba pero tu pendo na ngu tuvid. Ado no mbe nkonta mene na ngu panj. Nalo de shapo. Ndife na confidence ati isoro ifuide. Na ba wina na ngu ifu meduro. Abanto na ipa na ipa. Ne chimuida. De randa na ne chimuida. Icha kwe bati. Nde bati ni abaja wale kwa ta. It's in Tina Nipe or Nipe. So, by a penny, Bala Papa, see to that to be your turn of a pair of bachelor for a body. Bala de a combi. Narabe cut idea sacks, ill twitter sacks, and in Shivashi sheet. Capendo cashi sheet, I'm a lot. Mambo could gain in. Eng and I cut a sacks, the other sanguat, now winner. But upon Debe cut it a sacks, and position evy, Narabe cut sacks in Jingle and a kid. Abantu bari abeni abari tamba ba shire randa cha umwa icho ala chinge ama pinda muk ukfumarero ukfumarero ni kamiliyo ni efo ya fumafya sini ba mbwa randa tio muti kwa dibo muntu kamiliyo ni tene kamiliyo ni ya shire sio umla ndo wa confidence na kuite pa draft okay. All right, mm -hmm. William. Let's talk about the recent championship, the national championship, where you you were given the title uh, Federation Master. Mm -hmm. How was that tournament for you? Even as we'll be seeing the visuals of that championship, how was that tournament for you? And did you think you are going to win? Yes, of course. I I already planned to say I'm going to win that national tournament because when I was 12 years old in 2019, I came out third in the national tournament. Mm. Then in 2020... There we can see Grandmaster... Then in 2020, mm. we never had the national championship due to coronavirus issues. Mm. Then in 2021, we had the national championship, which was uh, last year held in uh, Charleston, Avondale. Then I came out second. Mm. Then uh, this year, I told myself to say, ah, no, I must become the champion, champion because... Uh, I must show to say I'm improving mm. day by day. Mm -hmm. So I used to practice hard day by day, and then I knew to say I'm definitely going to scoop the first position. Okay. I know you first tough opponents. Cameroon was one of them, and even the Grandmaster. How were the games? Were they very tough? Yes, the games, they were very tough. Of course, it wasn't so easy for me to win. They were a good number of strong and titled players such as Elijah Chanda, Mwaza Sakala, Grandmaster Richard Mwamba, 
and many others, it wasn't easy for me. It's just that I prepared adequately for it in order for me to win it, since I knew to say uh, it is my turn to, okay. to become the champion. What did it mean to you winning the Federation Master title at a young age? What did that mean to you? It meant, it meant a lot to me because I knew to say uh, people from Brazil and many other countries would know to say William finally exists. They only saw me playing online games, so they thought as if I'm being helped by someone or I used to use a computer program, mm -hmm. but now they finally so to say, they finally knew to say that William truly exists and is a strong player. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, this, the, this is the title that you won at OIDC. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> nice, and uh, Chameleon, Chameleon came second, right? Second. Yeah. Okay. Chameleon, yeah, this is the tournament here at OIDC, a national championship. Yeah, yeah, of course. No, I'm going to have to say that. I'm going I'm a prayer that you now wake up and son. So, Mukoso Koyako said in a Nadi won't say experience. Experience, Idiaine, Nadi Quetene Chimwede Chakwevati, Nangunai Kos, Nimbona won't say, Valatea win a bat in a Nada Quata Ichimweda, Gafidafini, Vajava Shidendinica. Chameleon, I'm a desert. I couldn't man. I didn't know how to teach him either. It's a cool vibe. The direction is your band, Nick. The warm bathy, a bathy. The warm be okuringa na. Nishita eyo ban perere po chameleon. So nadi sa va penda. Nadi sa sangwati. Nadi pepe shafi atimfume. Panamba no ban be kaja ma pre asana ama pre erotule ingira. Van being a bade in Giramu boxing. Kulaba, Van Bivada and Dati Nara 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 Mum. Mm -hmm. Zamenian Pacti Van Cadenamant. Mm -hmm. So in a Pongera Murini a draft, quite a fair child. Nine a canshin Zamenian. My prayers ever can influence at you. Mm. To Zakumenium ground that child, not where I could stay. <laughs> Na pwera kuchaya individu. So imu... Okay, but nga tautu mwakumana na William. Ibasan, how is the game nga mwakumana na William? Umuwa icharate. <laughs> Umuwa icharate ya Jera Stown. Mm. Ifine, na ine nde umfabu ino pakuti. Tuwa wako haba iche ama champion. So, ah, alo mfuiko umuwa ichari. Fina William. <laughs> <laughs> you see, Morgan, that, that's why I like Chameleon. Mm. He's, got, he's a true sportsman. That's mm. good sportsmanship. And this is the culture we want to inculcate in our players to acknowledge when somebody is doing fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So right. when you acknowledge when somebody is better than you, that's the beginning of a good step. So Indeed. He's Great. in the right direction. All right. So before we go, let me find out how much have you prepared, William, for the World Championship and what can you promise Zambians? Uh, first of all, I'm very much excited and happy to have such a huge opportunity to participate in the World Youth Championship because I know to say uh, I'm capable of uh, winning the World Youth Championship and uh, of course bring medals and good news to Zambia. Mm -hmm. Yes, I trust my capa capabilities. Then, uh, one more thing is that uh, I've been uh, looking forward uh, to have uh, such a huge opportunity to participate uh, in such a huge tournament which consists of uh, different countries from Europe, from Asia, Africa itself and uh, many others. So I can't just uh, leave this opportunity <laughs> mm. go away just like that. But you are very ready for this. Yes, I'm very ready to. What can we expect from you? Of course, we... First position. <laughs> First position? <Yes. laughs> wow. Nice one. We'll be waiting for that. Confidence. How do you feel about the tournament? I feel like the tournament is the tournament. The tournament is the tournament. So, the tournament is the tournament. The tournament is the tournament. The tournament is Jesus. Mm -hmm. So, we are Jesus. 
ewala mpira na wisdom ili aine wisdom ona kwete pa kufuma namba 2 mm -hmm. muzambia eo eo nkabo mfya na kulia pa apaso mm -hmm. anko ndefu aisha nkafume fe na namba 1 kaili kuri fe kalia ndeti na to munande so apa na na right era fe na late ya fe na ina ni individual mm -hmm. chatin na ine okay. ndei mwona wino, echo ndei loku, mfuile na reta amari za utasu. Kwa 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 mkusina na nguni nkanda, kala mwona fia taa, ine ndiri mpulake aloa wa soo, ine kuroresha na kumbi, mm. ndeta amari za utasu, mamuno mzambi. Nice one, nice one. Um, finally, William, what's the biggest thing you'd want to achieve in drafts? Of course, it's to win such huge tournaments like uh, in the youth categories and also in the senior ones when I participate in the, when I, have, when I have an opportunity to participate in the senior national world champion, I mean senior world championship in the future. I also promise to bring silver medals or gold, gold or Blondes. Okay, yes. and obviously you aspire to be a grandmaster one day. Yes, one day. Okay, I come in very quickly. In thirty seconds. Finish. Mule. Mufwa ishok chita. Mu drafts. Epe mufwa ishok chita achieve. Mu drafts. Change. Achieve. Chita nango. Epe mufwa ishok. When I mu drafts, I andi. Apo ishla chita retire. Defo enka enka kwani chefi aso na so. Defo enka kwani she kofi enka be kofi landlord. <laughs> <laughs> okay, nice one. Okay, anyway, to allow nobody in the party, and I know my very shock of Mfia Amaboko. I find the farm of Mfia Amolo. So, bore a idea up, bore juggling. The fire, I'm sure I got my machanda to my terrible bore. So, mm -hmm. so none of our idea up, bore a idea up. Like a million. So, take a year. So, it's meant for fun. So, William will be the first one. We have a champion who drafts first one. We sing a full So, take a look at the first one. So, take a look at the first one. So, take a look Okay. Time starts now. It's set. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> okay, at least six. And come a left to you. Okay. Before we go, here last number. Yeah, last. I'm wrestling. Up. William and a chameleon. He, he can come here. <laughs> yeah, last. Good, Aisha, much. Mm -hmm. So, okay. So, Camilo, you have to with your You rest your arms here. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, you're going to put that one, two, three, go. That's when you go. One. One, two, three, go. 20-year-old versus... Nine uh versus sixteen year old. Is it William or is Camillion? <laughs> Nanu ara ponyomu nankwe. William is getting stronger. Camillion is also getting stronger. Wow. <laughs> Camillion. We shall have one family. Camillion. Nangu sh. Ah, Camillion. Have one family. Well done. <laughs> okay, so we end here. I was the hosting. Did you did you come here? Camillion. <laughs> Camillion. <laughs> Elijah Chanda. And also William Christian Chinzewe, they are going to the World Drafts Youth Championship. And hopefully by the time they come back, they'll come back with medals. Until next week, at the same time, my name is Modern Ntapechera Sinkala. Goodbye. Remember to send messages for that question I asked you. Bye-bye. Thank you.